Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. While road safety is at the top of the list for the two-year road plan being considered by the Kentucky legislature, there are a few new road projects on that list. One of those is a $14 million project to build a new access road to Pikeville's Kentucky Enterprise Industrial Park. Pikeville's Economic Development Director Sean Cochran says the park is already technically full and a second access road will soon be a necessity. We've worked with Representative Blanton and uh, some other uh, representatives uh, in Frankfurt, and uh, we're, we're excited to say now that yeah, that the money is in place uh, with House Bill 202, you know, provided it passes through the Senate and, and the governor sign it. Cochran said initially consultants said it could take as many as 10 years to fill the park, but after the first year, several companies signed agreements to occupy the entire park and things continue to move forward. Uh, you know, you get to the point where you're like, okay, I want to start seeing some things on paper, and that's where we are now. We're still, you know, we're getting to that point. Obviously, Silver Liner, that deal's already complete and signed and, and uh, going, and he should be in production. You know, he's, as a matter of fact, he's doing interviews this weekend. The new access road will be built on the back side of the park, giving an additional option for large trucks to access the property. Work will begin as soon as House Bill 202 passes in the Senate and is then signed by the governor. In Pikeville, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.